Hey guys, G Tech Lifestyle back with another bit of news on the Terra Luna fiasco. Apparently, Terra Luna uh, 2.0 price pumped to $30. As I understand it, it didn't actually pump to $30, it actually pumped to $20. Luna 2 prices crashed, yes, it did crash, 88% after reaching all time high of $30 on Saturday, right after the launch. Despite the recent um, mishap, Terra Luna has a chance of rallying to 185% due to mean revision. A breakdown of the 3.5 support level, which is actually did come down to 3.50, then went up to about 7, then it went up to something else. Uh, no, it went down uh, to about 5, 5.40, and it stayed there for quite some time, actually. And will create a lower low and then inevitable the bullish thesis okay so they reckon it's going to go higher right i've got another bit of news here uh Teluna has been resurrected after its 40 billion collapse it's already crashing yeah we know that uh Teluna's lost into that. as a height of the old lunar now as lunar classic had a second to supply of over 40 40 billion the revived lunar token is already take uh, trading on exchanges but its price is crashing yes it did crash and we know that <coughs> excuse me guys the terror unit um, and usd is well known is what's known as the album it's they've gone it relied on code and an assisted token luna to maintain its one value but at the, they did as digital currencies prices fell investors fled to stable coins sending usd tumbling and taking luna down right currently the price of terror classic is and it's got a, it went up to uh, 60 percent plus actually i think it was at 90 and 98 percent it's just about down to uh, um 60 percent and the classic or well, the new one get that price up this one um 13 percent now i don't know which one i want to half at the moment i really don't and i don't know if hanging on to classic whether it be re resurrected or not whether they will the community um, because there's a lot of community backlash against um, Luna 2. People prefer the classic, even though they got an airdrop in Luna 2. Most people prefer classic, and I think I have to agree with them because look at looking at the figures on the classic. You know, it looks like it wants to go back to where it was. So I'm not Joe Kwan. I'm not anybody who is uh, um, in that realm of saying, "Oh, you." Uh, uh, or or code or anything like that but wouldn't it be better to to peg it to usdc as opposed to usdt which was the failure whereas usdc seems to be much more stable is um recognized is going to be um a token of the i said 2022 standard personally speaking i'd want to i'd rather go for uh, um, usdc and work with that and revive uh, the classic i think over time that might happen no promises i'm not a financial advisor don't take this as, as financial advice however that said don't get scammed stay regulated take care guys